your, uh, <laughs> your light skinned baby Bizoy, uh, aka Pink Panther. <laughs> Hashtag Pink Panther. Oh man, only, yeah, only real tra- yeah. only real trillions know this. Yeah. You know what we mean by that? Yeah, uh, yeah. Go back and listen to the last two episodes to find out. Uh, um, your boy Drizzy Drake is. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna be real with you, man. He's he's running he's running the billboards right now. The song "God's Plan" is now been on the top of the Billboard singles for six straight weeks. Hold it strong. It's pretty strong run yeah, there. It's a uh, strong run. He might he might do another week at the top. So. It's looking like it. Um, I think he actually may hold a couple more weeks. You know, a few more weeks possibly. 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 I mean, um, what do you? I mean, with the, the extent of the YouTube video doing this numbers, the YouTube videos doing numbers. Uh, yeah, yeah. What do you? Um, uh, it, well, it, it, I mean, first off, what do you think about about this run, man, for, for Drake? I think it definitely proves that you know he's not gone. Right. He, he's still here, and he still has his, his supporters. You know that that still backing him. You know, they're still he's still holding strong. He's gonna we're gonna get an album, and he's gonna do some numbers. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure that's gonna happen. Right. right. If this is happening. I'm sure like what we'll, we're gonna get some more Drake more Drake time, like holding possibly a crown and dethroning a crown right now of who's holding the top. <laughs> you think, so you think he's the dethroning uh, K-Dot, I think it's, K-Lamar? I think it's happening slow. I mean, unless Kendrick comes out with something soon, you know, not exa- like real soon, but like something that can actually like contend with it maybe a month or two months after a Drake right. release, you know, then he could possibly keep it back. Like, okay, hold up. But it's almost a little battle now, a battle for the well, top. It is uh, at the time, uh, and, and I don't. And um, Kendrick's not there anymore. But the Black Panther soundtrack was number one in the country at the same time that Drake's song was number one in the country. Is, that, that's kind of the battle right now because yeah. that is pretty much a, a K dot baby album, as you, as you right, said. Right. It's like it's pretty much an album. His album. Well, I don't know if uh, if you. <laughs> the interesting thing is if if you put them both out at the same time. They're both putting out singles, both putting out albums at the same oh, time. Man. Who is gonna reign as number one? I'm gonna go ahead and say actual that, battle. yeah, an actual battle. I would go ahead and say that Drake will probably reign as number one. Only reason I say this, not because I think Drake is better than than Kendrick, mm-hmm. uh, is because Drake is just way he's just popular. Yeah. There's people that don't even listen to fucking rap music. Yeah, there's a popular that factor. listen to Drake. Yeah, you know what I'm there's saying. A popular factor. They don't know nothing about a fucking Nipsey Hussle or a fucking Kendrick or a fucking. J. Cole. Uh, J. Cole or fucking whoever you know what I'm saying yeah. they don't listen to that shit they listen to Drake because they like that shit yep. it's because he's gonna make songs on there that reach you know fucking reach the world 14 year old yeah. fucking girls in fucking Sweden yeah. you know what I'm saying they like the shit yeah. that's, that's the just, type of artist Drake is yeah. Kendrick that's the is gonna drop some shit that maybe the 14 year old girl in Sweden is just not gonna be feeling alright yeah She's exactly like, well, that's a little that's a little too gangster it's a little too racy too too too, too, too uh it's too hood it's too too west coast yeah it's, <laughs> it's too lyrical why does yeah. it have to be lyrical yeah for real uh, or, i just don't understand it yeah because <laughs> it's not it's yeah. not me yeah 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 uh but I, I honestly think that if drake dropped damn uh that damn uh what's the song dna drop dna at the same time that this song drop uh, god's plan Uh, different story. DNA is. Uh, <laughs> just, uh, I think DNA no. might. My edge might take, Yeah, my, my, the DNA came out. It was that was the. He was snapping. Yeah, you know what I'm saying that shit was all, everywhere. I don't know, man. Uh, I think, that took, I think it, Drake <laughs> took his time away from the game because I don't think he wanted to compete with Kendrick when Kendrick was, was doing his rollout. Yeah. Uh, so when like, Kendrick died down, Drake was, was right there. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying. Man, the fact that, that was all. That was, Hell yeah, that, that, was, that was definitely. Yeah, that. they had a, a discussion. I was like, yo, uh, oh, they had a discussion. Like, yeah, his you, team and shit. Well, oh yeah, yeah. I thought you met him and Kendrick at first. Like, no. was like hey, you're gonna drop him in the way after. Nah, <laughs> nah. I think I think he got a discussion too. It's like, yeah. All right, Kendrick's killing it right now. Let's let's just, just wait. let him have. Let's not try to fight it because yeah. we, we might lose this one. You know what I'm saying? I think that's why they, I think they yeah, fell back to me. I, I feel it. I feel it. Like, I, yeah. I can see that. But I do like it though because it does feel like a competition. 
And I, I do like when it's competition. I like competition. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Makes Friendly everybody better. competition. Yeah. They're not dissing each other, just comp- competing just for that the top spot. Yeah, top spot. The sales. But I do, the ranking. I do believe that if Kendrick drops another like album that's lyrical, conceptual, and it's like commercial commercially uh Strong digestive to yeah, the yeah. ears oh, yeah. uh that it's going to it's it's, it's gonna go right back to oh hell yeah yeah, yeah it will yeah it will. Right when the last time we seen anything we seen anything like this no, no. what it was just like these two big, two big and they're kind of going back it. and forth like not without violence <laughs> <laughs> we haven't seen it without violence. not without guns yeah or Not like, without shootings, like, like chairs being thrown like on the stage, low blows and shit, right? Dissing Sneak disses and, and shit. Yeah. yeah, like without that, like when was the last time we seen something like this? I, I can't think. Of you it. can't even say Jay Z and Nas because nah. it wasn't like that with Jay Z. Nah, they actually were dissing each other and shit like that. Maybe too. J and M and uh and, and Nelly. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> the only dudes moving units M Pimp Juice and us. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, nah, hey. I, would, I think this may be a first. <laughs> this might be a first. This one might be a first. <laughs> uh, well, you know, shout out, shout out to the competition. Yeah. Shout out to the competition that's still wait, in I can't wait to, uh, to see what happens, how yeah. it turns out. Wait like, till J. Cole gets back in there. Oh, shit. He's like, hold up, I have something to say. If, if J. Cole me. figures out how to make a commercially uh, tasteful album that it has all of that the reaches conception, everywhere. it reaches everybody, then yeah. it's, that's, a, that's a real contender real run right there yeah. you know what I'm saying and uh, we that's have trifecta like we have a, like a triple threat of, like a contender cause J. Cole never really does, yeah, like I, when he puts out a video it doesn't do the numbers that Drake is doing or Kendrick Kendrick doesn't do the numbers that Drake is doing yeah you know what I'm saying so I think it would be really good for hip hop if something like that happened even, even if you throw Cole in the mix like right. and, like three people kind of going for it without even just, just like sneak this is like I'm number one you know when you're saying shit like that you're kind of telling them that you're right. not you're not the best well so, I heard Drake say something like shit he's top two right so I was like well shit who the fuck you think is number two because yeah. if you say you because he said something about like he's top two but he's not number two something like that you know what yeah, I'm saying yeah. and I'm like okay you trying to narrow it down like mm-hmm. alright uh interesting thing so, uh you're number four and five. Whoever the fuck those are, those are gonna be. Uh, Big Sean did say he was going. He called off his tour so he can go work on some music. Mm. So you know, I think he heard. I think he's, he heard what people are saying. He knows what's going on. He knows he needs to get on his shit. Right. He knows that he needs to. He needs to. Uh, he needs step to. it up and kind of <laughs> contend with what's going on because he has a voice that that's heard, but it's not being heard that the way it, it should be. Not like those two. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So it's like he knows he needs to. He needs yeah. to get in there. Yeah. Well, well, I guess we'll see. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. If, if that ends up happening. We'll see if, our, if what we're talking about ends up happening. Well, we'll Kanye see. comes back out. Oh, my goodness. Well, yeah. Mm-hmm. We got people who fucking are, have things to say, and they kind of fall back when other people are kind of reigning strong. Right. Like you said. So, yeah. That's there's, probably, yeah all of it is, there's a lot of shit dropping this out. year. I think Kanye's going to drop this year. I know Lupe's going to drop. Uh, there's going to be there's, there's going to be some heavy, heavy, yeah. heavy hitters coming this year. So, we'll see. Yeah, yeah.